Hello everybody. I hope you are doing well. So I wanted to do a little bit lighter of a reading today. Um, I wanted to look into um, the divorce, what the reason for the divorce um, between Cardi B and Offset. I love listening to Cardi B. She really gets me hyped when I'm cleaning. So um, I just want to see what's going on. Why? Um, I hate for anybody to hurt, you know, I'm just going to look into the dynamics of it. <clears throat> dynamics of the reason of the divorce and what's going on. So, you know, I'm just going to get into it. Spirit guys, angels, what? Why Cardi B filed the divorce from Offset? Why is Cardi B? Oh, I didn't drop all the cards, but get it together, Mexican lady. Show me why Cardi B and Offset. Cardi B filed for divorce from her husband Offset. Why is it Cardi B filed for divorce? Cardi B and Offset. We have the Ace of Wands, the Magician, there's the Strength card, Oops, got lucky. Um, the Wheel of Fortune, interesting, Two of Wands, very, very interesting, the Eight of Cups reversed, so. The Five of Swords reversed. Five of Cups. Oh, and we have the King of Wands reversed. Wow. Um, so, and then the Eight of Pentacles is in the reverse position on the bottom of the deck. So let's look at this. Let's see what we got here. Okay. So what we see, you know, what we see here with the Ace of Wands is obviously she this what set this or what sparked this into being sparked and set this off was some type of new information that came in or new insight that she received and wands for me it represents sexuality and you know having sex or the penis card so to speak so she found out some new information regarding him and his probably cheating. Um, and then with the magician, the magician is a creator. He creates things. And it's also about manifesting or, you know, manifesting for yourself what you desire. So maybe she found out um, something about Something he had created with his penis. So I would assume a baby possibly is kind of what I'm feeling here. She found out about something. She was she dropped all of her pre illusions that existed between them or her illusion of what was actually going on and she decided to create, you know, the energy that she wanted from the information that she got, basically. She got she got the information she used that information to her advantage to um, calm herself with this. The strength card represents finding inner courage, inner strength. Um, it's using your it's using calm, composure, and compassion to help you help and guide you. You know, finding balance, um, staying you know standing strong, and Finding a steadiness to yourself, steadying your situation, you know, she needed to, she used the information and I think she was kind of quiet about it and she quietly gathered everything she needed to gather in order to center herself and to put her, you know, have herself focused 
and stench her, you know, hole so that she could do what was necessary so she could have, you know, spin the wheel. She's, you know, wants to have changes. This is changes, fate, cycles. Um, you know, taking a risk. She and she wanted, she wants a life that has real emotions attached to it. And I just don't think that there was emotion from him to her. I think that she figured it out. As in, she figured out that he was only with her for a show, basically. He was putting on a show. Because then we threw the two of wands, and this is trying to make a choice between something that you've already... Or a wand that you already have, you're comfortable with and you know. Or striking out and going into the unknown. <clears throat> you know, maybe she had hesitated before. Maybe she had even given him the opportunity to change his actions. And that um, he did not change. He was a, he was a liar. He was a swirling pit of negativity and she had been so focused on that wand and that life and the empire almost that they were they were trying to build together or what she thought they were trying to build together. So she got a rude wake up call here with the Eight of Cups. She regrets that she let him come back before. She regrets that she didn't. That she let him take her strength from her, that he she let him that that she let him hurt her in that way and put her off balance. She regrets that she allowed him to control and tame her for so long, and she walk she she completely walked away. And abandoned and let go of that baggage that was existing. She found her strength. She found her center, her calm. And no matter what shifting energy came in or shifting emotions came in, she wasn't going to be thrown off anymore because she was smart about it this time. This time she didn't leave any way for him to get her back or any way to... Um, for it to hurt her anymore she cut off those emotions for it you know how we do <laughs> and then we see here with the five of swords and this reverse this is underhandedness this is sneakiness this is a liar deceitful so there was some money too he was there was something else that he was being deceitful about possibly money and his that he was a liar a cheater he was use he used underhanded methods to achieve what he wanted. He didn't feel guilty. He you know, and this is also a card of realizing that what you wanted isn't an option anymore. And that's what she's you know, this is a lot of what she realized. So she really had feelings and you can see that here with the five of cups that's after the five of swords. You know, she's heartbroken. She's, uh, I just hate it. She's grieving and facing a harsh reality. She's facing the reality of who he is and that he was putting on a show that he never felt for her what she felt for him. Horrible. Um, she was betrayed by him probably a lot. She probably found out a lot. Cause yeah, I just I just feel the energy of she found out a lot. That whatever this is, it's penis and created he used his penis to create something, of course. But there's also other information that came in that made that was callousted by this information. So something else happened. <clears throat> Maybe she found out that he was um, 
taking money from her or something like that or sneaking doing something underhanded to her and she didn't know because she was so focused on him and so ambitious and so you know so focused on this this life that she wanted with him that he that she didn't notice it um this is also releasing, you know, starting to re releasing yourself from the guilt, from the pain, from the resentment, you know, letting yourself feel the pain, but, you know, realizing the reality of your situation, you know, not allowing him to talk his way out of it, not even allowing him to talk. He didn't get to talk at all. She like, she was gone. She vamped type thing. He didn't know anything. She quietly tiptoed away and she blocked herself from him. She probably blocked him from any way of contacting her. Completely blocked and cut off contact from him so that she could gather herself and her composure, I'm sure. Because he, he had the ability to manipulate her. He, you know, he really did. Because here he is with the King of Wands reverse. But the King of Wands is very aggressive. And it has very volatile emotions. Maybe that's another thing. Maybe it scared her even. Maybe they had been fighting. Because I know that they had gotten back together after a previous time that he cheated. Maybe <clears throat> since then, you know, they've been harboring all of that. There's some type of animosity that's been going on. <clears throat> and I think he was aggressive with her. I think it's possible that he had, he was, he had become very uh, volatile and maybe even a little bit abusive to her in general. Mm mm mm. Makes me sad. I hate that for her. I I like that I see that she had real emotions and it wasn't just about money for her. But as you see with this card, this this um, guy is looking down at the pinnacles, the the fortune. He was only worried about money. He did not care about. And she had to think about herself. She had to love herself, you know. Again, self-love. Okay. Uh -uh. That really makes me, oh, I'm just so sad about it. Well, Cardi, I just want you to know that the risk was worth it. And as long as you come into a situation with someone the next time you allow someone in your life, you do it fully with your heart. Be smart and focus on the actions and not the words of somebody. Make sure that you, that they, the words they are speaking, they walk it like they talk it. Walk it, walk it like they talk it. He didn't. All right, y'all, I gotta go. <laughs> y'all have a great day. Thank y'all so much for watching it. Love y'all. Bye.